The flagship city food hall is welcoming a new restaurant. The owner says he is grateful for the opportunity to expand his business and return to his roots in the downtown Erie area. Brianna Malone joins us from the control room with more tonight. Brianna. That's right, Jen. Daryl Roberts of Triple D's Tasty Grill says the opportunity to move into the food hall was too hard to resist. A new tenant is moving into the flagship city food hall, Triple D's Tasty Grill. The owner says the idea of moving into the food hall presented itself previously. Moving into the food hall um, uh, was brought to me a couple months ago and uh, got the call, but I you know, wanted to fulfill my obligations in the Liberty Plaza, most of it I, as I could. But when opportunity came knocking, Robert answered. He says the atmosphere of the food hall encouraged him to take advantage of the move and present his food to the downtown community of Gannon, Erie Insurance, UPMC Hammett, and other surrounding businesses. Robert says returning to downtown Erie brings him back to 10th and State, where he first began his food endeavors with a hot dog stand. I'm actually nervous because it's like, you know, a new kid on the block and uh, you have to get your feet wet and uh, see how things start moving. I'm grateful for the uh, people down here who uh, thought of me and thought of my business. Uh, and just it, it just lets me know the hard work uh, that you put in. Don't go on notice. The experienced director of the Erie Downtown Development Corporation says Roberts contributes to the variety of food choices within the food hall. It is kind of this like collective environment where people can come and try different uh, creative food options and this is just a really awesome opportunity for Daryl to get his food out to an entirely new audience like right down here in downtown Erie. While guests are enjoying their favorite meal, Hoover says they can also participate in current and upcoming activities. As a lot of folks know, we already have karaoke, we have live music. Um, both of those are uh, karaoke on Tuesday from 6 to 8, live music is Wednesdays from 6 to 8 and now we're going to introduce trivia night on Mondays beginning January 22nd. Hoover also notes how there are other avenues for business and restaurants to expand in downtown Erie, even if the flagship city food hall may not be the best fit. Jen. Uh, all right, Brianna Malone live in our control room. Thank you, Brianna.